Jay Cassidy, who yes. has worked with for four decades and nominated for three Oscars. What was different about A Star Is Born? The music was certainly different. We had a lot of fun with the music, and uh, and it was an approach to the music because of the, the, their uh, Bradley and uh, Lady Gaga wanting to do live vocal. That was really uh, it was wonderful. You know, we, we you had to do a lot of mechanics to get it to that point, but it, it really paid off. And certain authenticity about the characters and the experience. And uh, this is the first time that a star is born has been made. So what did you take from the original Born Yellow remake in terms of the animation? You know, they, they're, they're all different. They made it different eras. And each, I think the editing of all of them reflect the, the interpretation of the time. I, that would be the way to say it. I certainly love the Judy Garland one and the Janet Gaynor one. And so, uh, but there, it's a different era and a different kind of directing, a different kind of photography. Now, and in, in our case, there was a different sort of interpretation of the story, and that's going to change the editing to what it needs to be. Now, when you're looking for awards uh, like the Oscars, what are you looking for in a film uh, that means a great film editing to you? You know, I. I think the, the editing uh, awards are reflective of the films, and if they're great films, they, those films tend to get nominated for the editing. You know? I mean, it's very hard to pull it apart. Yeah. Uh, but like, you especially, do you find that you can dig a bit deeper, or is it just kind of your look at the best films? Because of my profession? Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think you, you dig much deeper, so, you know, it's... It's just, am I as good an audience as anyone? And you know, if you're a good audience and uh, you love films, you know, you, you appreciate what you see, and you know, and, and that, and if there's sort of commonality to that, that gets recognized. An Emmy for the night of. Yes. Uh, you've done a couple other pilots. Yeah. Now you talked about how you don't or how you prefer film because of the like the viewing experience. Yes. Uh, when you consider doing television, would you kind of like stick with a certain style and certain characters? And... Well, I I think that's a good point. I should have said that in in there. You know that the. the the television is giving filmmakers and storytellers a way to tell serialized stories, and uh, that's fantastic. You know, and I love watching them, and you love uh, living with stories that develop over you know ten episodes instead of just a you know two-hour block. So there, there's there's a real st storytelling opportunity that's going on right now that you know really smart filmmakers are taking advantage. And finally, uh, what work are you most proud of as you're making all this of your career? Um, that I'm still standing. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, thanks very much.